Hello world, let's do this. Yeah guys, we're up to trick number 11, oh, one, two, three, of the braille skateboarding challenge I've got set for myself. And if you watched the last few videos, you know the sun is really glary and all that sort of stuff and I'm not in the ideal space, so forgive me if this is a bit wonky, like as far as bright and dark. Yeah guys, so we're up to trick number 11 and it's the front side 180 and this is what it looks like from the guys at Braille. So as you know I can ollie from the last video and I've ollied moving and I've ollied over something. And now it's doing a front side 180. I don't know, it's been a while since I've done this. I might even have to try and do it up a bank. But I'll give it a go. So we're going to be ollie. I'm gonna try moving. I'll try standing still first. So yes, if you haven't watched the other videos, early videos, I had trouble with the autofocus. So I'm still trying to use the autofocus, so I'm hoping that it's not doing, I won't know until it's back in there, back in the computer. Oh, yeah. Well, I rolled away. But the, I guess the idea is to go and keep going backwards. I reckon it would be easier going up a bank than... Oh. Come on! That got to be close. I didn't roll, but I flicked around. So when I did the boneless, I heard this side, I wonder if this side is starting to ache because I'm not used to doing that movement. <laughs> so yes, if you're learning to skateboard for the first time, or after many years, just be mindful it uses a lot of different muscles that you probably don't normally use. Turn, and it's not the full 180. 
Ah, oh, that was it. There's one in the right spot. Going backwards. <laughs> Front side 160. <laughs> Like I said, I'm getting fatigued. That's when you get sloppy. Mistakes happen, so you gotta be careful. That's close enough, isn't it? If I can do another one, I'm counting it. Let's see, if I was on a hill, I'd go away. I'll see if I can do one more. I'm landing it. I'm just getting tired for the rotation. It. Come on, I'm going backwards. I'm landing. That counts. I'm going to count that. Tell me in the comments if you don't think I should count that, but I went up the driveway and did one. It is much easier on a bank, so it's actually quite hard. It's harder on the flat, I find. So, yeah, that's awesome. So I'm gonna claim, like I'm claiming that. That's trick number 11, 11, 11. It's down. Yeah, guys, if you like the video, smash like, hit subscribe, and all that good stuff. But I don't know how long it'll be for the next one because we're getting into the harder tricks. So that was 11. There's four more. There's the next one is the Oli North. And I don't know about that. I'm not that good of an ollier. Ollie North is where you pop it up and your front foot comes off and then back on. So I don't know how that goes. I might have to cheat that. <laughs> um, I can't remember what number 13 is. Number 14 is the big spin. And that'll take me ages to get down. So, because I'm not that good at shove it. And as you saw, I'm not too crash hot with body burials. So that's a combination of the two. <laughs> So, it'll be a while before I get to the kick, the kick point by this rate. But yeah, the next one is going to be the Nolly North. What is number 30? Anyway, that is for another time. 
as you know, I'm already sore from a couple days ago. And this one's sort of like aching some muscles. I landed wrong, my knees are hurting. I'm not complaining. It just means I just can't film anymore today. So as I said, I'm not complaining. You know why? Because I'm not dead yet. <laughs>